When the power's out, it's really a life-changing event. Nick Bentley. We don't realize how much we do depend on electricity. Is one of Georgia Power's finest linemen, one who loves to help customers. You know, that's a big feeling, you know, when, when the customers do come out and, and thank us for what we do. Today, he's on a special mission. And I really didn't know what all I was in for today when I volunteered to do this. Nick's visiting Annette Wynn Elementary School in Lithia Springs, where it's Thank Alignment Day. But safety excellence is on Nick's mind, so he plans to teach the students all about the dangers of downed power lines. I've got a family, you know, wife and three kids at home, and, and I want, you know, people to understand that downed power lines are dangerous. So let me see your school spirit. Annette Wynn Elementary School, spirit. Finally, the moment for the special mission had come. What's your name? Anastasia. Following a brief introduction from area manager Nadia Fawcett. Are all the kids in there? Or are they yeah. more fixing to come? It was time for Nick to do his thing. One, two, three. Good morning. After a rousing welcome, Nick wasted no time delivering a safety message. As kids outside playing, after bad weather's come through, there may be power lines on the ground, but we don't need to touch lines hanging off the power poles. Safety excellence message delivered. Now it's time to show off the bucket truck. You all want me to go all the way up? The students were pumped. Many had never seen a bucket truck. And as Nick floated away into the sky, It was an awesome scene to watch. The students were tremendously grateful. You are the superhero of the day. And one even took time to express his gratitude in a special note for Nick and his brother Lyman for all they do for Georgia Power customers. That's sweet. Thank you, Mr. Nick. Thank y'all. Yes, big thanks to Nick and his 800 plus brother Lyman. You know what you want for Christmas? What's that? A bucket truck? <laughs> I'm Craig Bell from Corporate Communications.